Hello guys, it's Shadowbot here and today we are going to be doing a new series of Bloodlines reviews, I guess you can say. Uh, I worded out that wrong. Um, but today we are going to be reviewing Renshiki, uh, one of the four legendary Bloodlines. Um, so if you guys are not familiar with this game, it essentially is called Shindo Life. I'm going to put the link down in the description so you guys can check it out. Uh, but the game is based off Naruto. Um, originally, it was called Shinobi Life, but you know, for copyright reasons, they had to do a bunch of changes to the game. But let's get to the topic of today. So, this, so the Bloodline is called Renshiki. Um, it's by far one of my favorite Bloodlines to use, and it's like you know, and this whole entire game, it's like you know, it's one of my favorite, my main. Um, so we are going to be seeing the first move or the first skill um, Absorption So Renshiki style absorption. Oh my god um, So basically It absorbs enemy hits and turns it into chakra. So Let me use my chakra my chakra. Okay Let me leave Let me Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, see? So it uses... It basically gate and gives me chakra. Um, and I'm not sure if the opponent loses chakra. Let me ask him. Did... Did you lose... Chi? Did you lose Chi? Yeah, so it doesn't, you know, it doesn't, it doesn't take away the opponent's sheep, but I do gain chakra. Yeah. Yeah, it's basically like an auto dodge. You gotta do it correctly. Yeah. Yeah, no. Yeah, it doesn't take chakra away. So, that's absorption. Now, Kami Hammer. Um, I want to review that one last since I need the mode to use this one, which is kind of cool, I guess. Um, so we're just going to go straight to the third one, Kami Bomb. So Kami Bomb is, if you guys don't know what Dragon Ball Z is, you probably won't get the reference. So it just summons a giant spear and it's, it's a, it's a glide thing. It's like a glide thing. No, it's like not a glide thing. It's uh, man, what do you call those? It, it went on tree. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh my, I, I can't even work that. I can't even say it today. Um, it's a, it's a aim. It's like you gotta aim it. Basically, you gotta aim the orb. So let me go over here. Yeah, and it has like a huge AOE, like a really huge area of effect. Uh, <laughs> oh, this review is going out splendidly. Alright, so, yeah, that's essentially what Kami Bomb is. It's just, it's just a giant spirit bomb. So now we are going to review the mode, which is one of my favorite. Uh, I did that. Um, yeah. <laughs> it's awesome. You gain these axes, which is what I'm going to show you with the second mode. Not the second mode, the second skill or the second attack. Um, so, yeah, let me show you the second attack. And if I'm not mistaken, it has auto track. Yeah, it does have auto track. And as well as that, also, you know, you can use them as well. You can use the axis as well for, you know, your M1s. And it does have a Q spec as well. Um, difference between Tengoku and 
Ranshiki is the check them ones. Yeah, I already checked them ones. Yeah, I already checked them ones. Um, so the difference between Tengoku and Ranshiki, I don't know if Sengoku has it, but like, your Q spec is the truth seek norms. Um, I know if I'm not mistaken, his M1s or Tengoku's M1s are also the truth seeking orbs in a way, but you use them as your M1s. So, and it does have a short cooldown, which is kind of OP, I guess. Does 7,000 damage or 7k damage. Um, now, my C spec is like the third the third one, which was the Kami Bomb. Or the spear bomb, if you want to put it like that, and it's basically you can glide with it. It does a lot of damage. I don't know where you. Okay. It does like a a lot of damage. Well, yeah. Let me take that off before I run out. Um. Just review the stats. So it gives me a pretty decent amount of stats. Um, it does give me stat boost. I'm at max, or not max health, but I'm at max for most stems. But it does gives it gives me a pretty good stat boost. Um, 74,000 chi, 7,600 nin, 76 tai, and 2,300 HP. I don't, I know I just said thousand for chi, 2,400 for chi. You guys know what I mean. Jeez. Um, but yeah, that's red shiki. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm going to reviewing Tengoku next. Maybe tomorrow, maybe today, I don't know. But this is what by far my favorite bloodline in the entire game. But yeah. I hope you guys enjoy. Subscribe to my channel, like the video. Um yeah, peace out.